Yes, good afternoon, good morning, good evening everyone. Just a quick clip uh, on the Great Escape. Uh, a couple of people have been asking how to do the escape. Uh, so there are two ways to do the escape. So I'm up to the kind of the same way, but the one I want to pick up here is uh, being pointed out to me by David Thomas because one of the big things about the game is it always said that there was more than one way to escape the camp. And uh, I just took that as... Um, just a little bit of fun in the instructions, but it turns out there actually is a second way out of the camp. And uh, we're just going to do a little bit of loading here because we have a file um, that, that I call the, the Night of the Escape. And uh, just to set the scene, uh, previously uh, we've buried our compass out in the fields outside the Prisoner of War camp. Hello, Commandant. Good news, Commandant. I'm going to be leaving very, very soon. It's going to be like leaving now. Right, so we'll try that again. I think you can put your head up with the uniform, but then you've got to go down and swap it out again and get the timing. It's just really, really awkward. Hi, Cycle Shopper. We're still trying to escape, but we might have done it. We might be doing it. The compass is the other side of the wire. Wire cutters are waiting for me. We've stolen the documents from the camp office. We're going to give it a go tonight. There's the wire cutters we need. And we're just going to have to trust our luck here. Push the luck, push the luck, push the luck. Find the sweet spot on the wire. Find the sweet spot under the wire. There we go. Our compass is waiting for us. Drop the wire cutters. Grab the compass. Compass, documents, run away! You've escaped from the camp and will cross the border successfully! We're just going to speed up the spectrum here. It's night time. Let that go through. And just sleep through the night. Now, previously we've uh, run out here and went under the wire. But now, we're going to head off to roll call. We've got a hold of the documents in our pocket. We've also got the fake German uniform. Worked it out yet? No. Uh, and I hadn't either. I've got to thank David Thomas for this one, who left a comment on the full review back at RetrospectrumGaming.com. That'll take to the YouTube channel. Uh, and he'd done a complete deconstruction of the code, how it all worked to investigate the AI uh, and to convert it to other platforms. And it's a really nice bit of code. Um, the link is it's davespace.co.uk slash the great escape. Uh, but we'll have the link in the comments at the bottom of the videos of this one as well. And he showed me where the other way to escape was. So thank you for that one, David. And turns out the instructions were kind of telling the truth. Not only can you go under the wire, but you can go out the main gate. Let's do roll call first. As always, of course, uh, here, uh, we are letting the game run on autopilot. You're just following the routine of the camp, but we've got everything in our pockets to do. The so-called, well, this won't be the great escape, this will be called it. <laughs> Same thing, we got to, been called it so they didn't steal the uniform they made it uh, and they didn't steal any guns or anything they um they took them and uh, glued cardboard together from all the red cross food parcels and made it look like a gun and a rifle and so breakfast time so here we go fingers crossed we can get this to work this time sneak into the red cross room and while nobody's watching we'll put the uniform on and i will just wait here till everybody gets into breakfast about now and is everybody going to breakfast I'm not going to go to breakfast I'm going to move down here now it's quite sneaky this one because you can't actually see where you're going but you walk up to the gate you use the papers and you walk out the front door with the German uniform on. And now, of course, 
you can sneak back down to where we buried the compass. Slight bug in the code that means you can't actually see everything that you like to pick up. There's the uh, documents and ID papers. There's our compass. And as before, we can run off the screen, you've escaped from the camp, and we'll cross the border successfully. Lovely. Now, it's not a complete solution of always going through the gate because you still need to bury the compass outside. And because you can only carry two things and you need the uniform and the papers to get through the gate, you can only do that at the end. So you've got to go under the wire once to bury the compass and come back in again. And then you can either go back out under the wire a second time, as we did in the review, or you can just wait till the morning, put your uniform on, walk out the front gate. And that will get you back home. And that is the other way to run the escape in The Great Escape. Have you enjoyed this video? Would you like to see more? Before you click through to watch something else, why not follow the link to help me make more fun reviews, clips and content?